Hello friends. Today we are reading My Home. The author is Rukmini Banerjee. The illustrator is Rajiv Verma Banjara. The translator is Manisha Chaudhary and the publisher is Pratham Books. So let's read My Home. This is my home. In this picture, you can see this girl standing here at the front entrance to the courtyard of her home. And she is showing us her home. Let's see what is in her home. I live here with my whole family. You can see in this picture, here is the girl's mother, her little brother and her father. And they are in this home living with the little girl. We take off our shoes and chappals here. What do you see in this picture? You can see a, a line of shoes and chappals just outside the house. So before entering, somebody who wants to enter the house would take off their shoes or chappals and then enter the house. This is where we wash our face and hands. So there is a tap and buckets and this is where when somebody enters the house, what do you do? You wash your hands and you wash your face, right? So this is where people would do that after entering the house. I hang my clothes on the hook. So you can see these hooks here where they hang their clothes like a shawl or a coat. They're all hung up here. My grandfather keeps his stick in the corner. So what is here? This is her grandfather's walking stick and he keeps it in the corner, leaning against the wall. The corner where these two walls are meeting is where her grandfather keeps his walking stick. We also keep our mats there. So in the same room, you can see these mats, they're all rolled up neatly and leaning against this cupboard. My father keeps his motorcycle outside. You can see this motorbike and it is kept outside the house. Here's the house's front door and the motorcycle is outside. But his helmet is on the cupboard. So you can see on top of this cupboard is her father's helmet. A helmet is a protective hat that you wear on your head to protect and cover your head and face when you're riding a motorcycle. And this is the helmet and her father keeps it on the cupboard. My mother and grandmother keep their saris in the trunk. So this trunk, it's like a suitcase, like a big suitcase with a lid and it has a latch. This is where the girl's mother and grandmother keep their saris.
tasty food is cooked in the kitchen and here is the kitchen of the girl's house you can see the gas stove and gas cylinder you can see something is on the stove and you can see fruits and vegetables and something is cooking something very tasty when it is cold we bring out quilts so these are quilts they are blankets with padding inside that keep you warm in the winter so when it is cold the quilts are taken out from storage and they use the quilts to stay warm when it is hot we use a fan you can see in this picture the girl's grandmother is sleeping and if it gets hot there is a fan when we have important guests we bring out the chairs so you can see here that there is a table and there are chairs where these people are sitting and they are important guests the girl's mother is bringing something hot to eat and there are biscuits and they're all here sitting on the chairs you must come and visit my home come soon so in this picture the girl is telling us welcoming us to her home to come and visit come and spend some time with them and she says come soon thank you the difficult words in this book are corner a place where two sides or walls meet trunk a large box with a lid for storing clothes quilt a blanket with padding inside visit to spend time with someone at their home or place of work helmet a hard hat to cover and protect your head try these questions what is the story about who are the people who live in the girl's home what all things in this story are also there in your home 